There's a motion on urgent need to investigate the status of NNPC crude oil and products distribution pipeline network, butanization plants and depots across the country, standing in the name of Honorable Toby Okechuku. Honorable Okechuku is now invited to move the motion. Federal Constituency from Enugu State. The motion is on urgent need to investigate the status of NIPC crude oil and products distribution pipeline network, butanization plants, and depots across the country. The House notes that the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation crude oil, product, crude oil products distribution pipeline network is a vast pipeline network measuring 5,120 kilometers and compri comprising 21 distribution depots, nine LPG depots, pump stations, houses, and other ancillary fa facilities spread across Nigeria. The House also notes that a pipeline distribution network is the nerve center of operations within the downstream sector as it transports crude oil and refined petroleum products to and from the refineries, depots, and jetties. And as a national grid pipeline, it traverses the entire Nigerian space, including Port Harcourt, Aba, Enugu, Makodi, Wari, Benin, Auchi, Lokoja, Eskravos, Musimi, Atlas Cove, Ejibo, Ibadan, Ore, Abadi, Suleja, Kaduna, Kano, Gusau, Jos, Gombe, Yola, Medugri, etc. The House is aware that the nine LG, LPG depots, which cost billions of naira to build, have not been put to use over 20 years since their construction. In spite of challenges of accessing cooking gas or LPG by most Nigerians, thus leading to decay of pipeline and depots. It is also aware that the network, which is managed by the Pipelines and Products Marketing Company, PPMC, a subsidiary of NMPC, also supplies refined petroleum products to strategic locations and distribution depots from where tankers leave products to designated retail outlets across Nigeria. The House is worried that the non-utilization of the pipelines has led to petroleum and other products being conveyed through the roads, thus resulting in countless incidents of petroleum tanker explosions in various parts of Nigeria, and also exacting heavy tolls on the road network. The House is alarmed by the report that the PPMC, the product distribution arm of NMPC, accounted for 87% of, of the over 350 billion loss incurred by NMPC in the first eight months of 2015. The House is convinced that a fully functional and efficient products pipeline distribution network and the operational butanization plant will reduce accidents and gridlocks in our highways and save Nigeria huge sums of money, both in man hours and road maintenance. The House resolves to mandate the Committee on Petroleum Resources Downstream to investigate the status of NMPC product distribution pipeline network and butanization plants and report back to the House within four weeks for further legislative action. I so move. I represent Abanot, Abasa Federal Constituency. I rise to second the motion, heavily moved by my colleague, Honorable Toby Okechuku. I so second. Oh, yeah. I represent Yenagoa, Kolokuma Opokuma Federal Constituency of Bayelsa State. My amendment is based on the fact that uh, the motion actually talking more about gas in terms of LPG pipelines that are spread across the country.
therefore, my amendment is to seek this honorable, the leave of this honorable house to add the Committee on Gas Resources in the investigation. Thank you. Any second? I rise to second the amendment moved by Honorable Diri. I so second. The ayes have it. Those in favor of the motion as amended say aye. Those against it say nay. The ayes have it. 